I'm gonna, I'm purposely doing something for a reason. Look at my bow. Is there a problem? How many of us hunt ground blinds? How many of us have to have an arrow knocked if you want to actually kill something? If you want to set your bow against the wall, make it look all pretty and never shoot nothing, that's fine. But if you knock an arrow like I do while you're in a blind, in an oval shaped blind or even square, where do you put your bow? With a 28 inch arrow and a broadhead on it against the wall like I always have. And always <laughs> when you try to pick it up and the moment of truth comes. So now, X tag. Byron has three models of tactical bipod that goes right on his scout, Picatinny style accessory that goes, it's not a stabilizer, but it's the accessory that goes around your stabilizer, like this one right here, this dual. I love this dual one, and it weighs nothing. Now, a Byron also has his own stabilizers, but these things will go from basically like eight inches to 16 inches of length. But what I mean by that is I purposely brought this Anarchy HC out here because it's 35 inches axle to axle or a little bit more than that. And now everything is 32, 30, 28, but it don't make any difference. Byron makes a bipod that match any bow that you possibly could ever want to shoot or get this. This is not only a Picatinny style, but this will work with a weaver as well. So not just for bows, but for ARs, any type of firearm that has a Picatinny or a Weevil style, a Weaver style, style mount on the bottom. It works. I love it. I thought, man, I'll never put a bipod on my bow. That just seems like a little bit of overkill. That got good to you, didn't it? See that? Just to any length. Not only that, but he's got shorter models. So no matter what bow, kids bow, women's bow, man's bow, don't matter, whatever bow. If you don't use one of these bipods, the two things that I can tell you that I would start, number one, number two, number three, bang, you're done. You got a camera mount, you got a bipod, there your bow is sitting there. And me in a blind, check this out. Got the wrist sling just like that, air is knocked. Bow's pointing straight away, I'm sitting like this. There's my intended target. All I gotta do is pick it up, draw back. And yes, my friends, I can show you the footage of me shooting with that bipod on. It absolutely does not change the point of impact at 20 yards. It might at 50 to 100, but what I've experienced out to 40 yards, it absolutely don't bother it at all. Another quality product from Byron Champagne at X-Tag, the tactical bipod, a must for any serious bow hunter or target archer.